going to be the best Mercury retrograde message? You've caught the lover's card. What? This Mercury retrograde is really asking you to tune into your heart and really listen to what it truly wants. This is going to be so key if you're wanting to make 2023 the year of me, the year of main character energy, and really creating the life that you have always wanted to live. You're looking for something more satisfying and fulfilling for you moving forward. Something where there's not a lot of competition, where you're actually surrounded by people who love you and lift you higher. But you need to cut some cords and truly make some kind of hard decisions. If you need help with that, I have my Dream Life Workbook and it's only $11.11. .11. There is a really big money opportunity coming in for you, but what you need to realize is all of that heartbreak and trauma and stuff that has been happening this year, that has been God's protection. Anything that was not aligned with your destiny and your purpose and your path has been eliminated from your life. Yay! You're kind of in this phase right now where you're a little bit of this like, I'm fine, I'm fine, everything is fine, but everything is not fine. But it is fine because you got the four of wands. Look at her, her little stand and stuff. It's like, you're going to be able to really make a name for yourself in 2023. Light a match and set fire to anything that does not make you feel the way that you want to feel. If your main character energy is elevated, ethereal, and evolved just like mine, then if it does not make you feel elevated, ethereal, and evolved, don't do it. If you want to feel like a mother effing boss, then anything that doesn't make you feel like a mother effing boss, get it out of your life. Then trust your intuition. Your intuition will always steer you in the right direction, and it is the key to navigate to those big opportunities and your real love. Finally, romanticize the F out of your life. That's right. I said it. You need to embody more of that rom-com Disney princess. Everything is so magical and wonderful or whatever your vibe is because you could definitely have a villain vibe because a villain era is th there for some signs. But I'm just saying you need to Fall head over heels in love with every single area of your mother effing life. This is the key to getting everything that you want. Like, follow, comment if this resonates. Mentorships are open. Apply link in bio. I love you.